and welcome to part two of the bow druid before i even begin i'm aware that part one is still unavailable because i decided to play bark at the moon by ozzy osbourne i'm trying to get that i'm trying to get that taken care of so it'll affect the uh the stream archive and basically as le as the least that i can um, if worse comes to worse, I'll have that part just completely muted in general. But YouTube's taking fucking forever to do anything. Because, like, I even put in the option to, uh... Like, I tried to put in the option to just mute the song, but they're taking forever with it. So, hopefully, hopefully that gets resolved quickly. Um, for those of you who did not see the stream, here's what I farmed for. I actually found myself a feather claw during the stream. Got myself warm tongue because of the dexterity and dexterity attack rating and poison damage, although the attack rating doesn't matter that much. Chitons came on, this is an obvious choice. Big Bad Wolf Head because of the extra strength and dexterity. Also, Life Steal and Life Regen's nice. Zealot Rush for the increased speed and bonus dexterity. Got myself a Viper Cast for leveling. Slow Target, bonus dexterity, Life Steal. Pretty good. And I just have Shit Rings for... I, I need to get a shittier amulet than this. For... Resistant MOing resistances whenever I get the whenever I get what I need. Also, I got instinct and just a random axe. Anywho, let's move on. Now, I will also explain the gameplay for those of you who did not who missed the stream. So as we know, as most of us know by now, you have to use Steady Shot and then use cast, then use your Cascade or Heart Seeker, or as I call it, Homing Nova Shot, because that's what it is. Actually, let me look at this amulet, see if it's any good. Okay, that's slightly better than what I have. Um, but if the bear here casts its heart of the, what is it, heart of the pack? that thing, that Nova, then you can just spam Cascade and uh, Homing Nova Shot, aka Heart Seeker, without it using uh, Steady Shot. I would have preferred it be an Aura, because that's what I was under the impression that it was going to be. But, whatever. Honestly, though, I do enough damage with uh, Steady Shot that I can just spam Steady Shot at stuff and not worry about it. I know for uh, bosses, I'm going to need uh, Heart Seeker, aka Homing Nova Shot. But whatever. Um, the Harvesters I just have here as summons just for extra meat shield. And the Bear is a pretty good meat shield as well. My current goals, as far as stats go, is to have enough dexterity to wear the tier 4 version of this bow without having the excuse me without having the bow itself equipped let's see is there anything else I'm missing oh yeah harvest uh, harvest doesn't really help that much it kinda does but not that well um, obviously I did Den of Evil off screen cause nobody needs well I guess technically if you didn't see the stream you won't be seeing Den of Evil for a little bit, but it's Den of Evil, though. Let's let's not kid ourselves. That's not particularly interesting. But let's see. What have I done? Okay. I have the Blood Raven quest active, but I don't need to do that. That's that's basically just waltz in there, use steady shot twice, and you're done. Yeah. 
So yeah, you have to switch between Study Shot and Heart Seeker constantly if you want to... Well, or Cascade, to use uh, Cascade and Study Shot, or Cascade and uh, Heart Seeker. Although, given that Study Shot currently does enough, I'll just be spamming it instead. Also, the mana's really nice. Also, yeah. Um, now, someone might be saying in the comments, uh, why don't you have this with the uh, Deadfall, since it ha since SOR got buffed. I thought of that, but I went with... Uh, I went with uh, Warm Tongue because of the lower strength requirements. In early game, that actually matters quite a bit. I mean, in end game, it's not going to matter at all because of uh, you get you getting enough charms to wear pretty much anything except for like the the great axe that has 4,800 strength requirement. Greenhorn's Charge, which has, I think, 2,700 uh, strength requirement. Actually, we'll kill De we're, we'll save Deckard Kane. Actually, wait, do I have... Okay, I do have that. Anyway. Um, but basically, out of anything I would wear, I have enough strength for... I'll have enough strength for that in endgame, so... Whatever. Nice. First Belladonna extract of the season for me. Uh, bear. Yeah, get in there, bear. Leave this place. I would pick up the perfect skull if level challenge 2 still existed, but it does not. So. Basically, Harvest d does that, and it restores your life, but it's honestly not that useful. So, pump it into dexterity. So, currently, I'm thinking I don't invest any more points in Cascade and Heartseeker because, like, I f don't think there's any more of a reason to do that. Steady Shot, you max. This is uh, Elfin Weapons. It gives you more movement speed and Movement speed, deadly strike, and innate elemental damage per level. So you max that, obviously. Bear companion. Um, I'm thinking max this just because of uh, heart of the pack duration, like that alone. So, bark skin. That's uh, life shield. So obviously you max that. Uh. I was thinking just leave one point in Harvesters, but then I looked at Symbiosis and seen that Harvesters give you faster life regen. They're basically the old, uh, um, Acid Fiends. I'll invest as many points as I need into that. It, but that will be once I get to level 115 and do... That'll be once I get to level 115 and do, uh... The Bayard Collie quest, etc., 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 etc. Um, and my bear got left behind, I guess. <clears throat> I do definitely need more resistances, but I have the MOs ready for that. So, well, I have the MOs for some of them. And I also, I think I have, I have some gold, so I can get some resistances.
and I am fully expecting them to nerf uh, the damage to steady shot or make it not multi-hit or something. Just to make it so that you you do have to use that you do have to use uh, Cascade in order to kill crowds effectively. Didn't gear my mercenary at all. Alright, so level 63, more dexterity, I'm gonna keep my points as is for right the second. area. I'm only... I would have done this off screen if this was, uh... If this was its old... Re like, if this was old median. Actually, I wouldn't do it at all if this were old median, since there's no point. But... Let's see what I get. Nothing of value. I.O. Shale... Lum. Okay, that's nothing. That is absolutely nothing. I forget offhand how many points I need into Dexterity to wear tier 5 or 4 equivalent of that. I think it's like 430-ish. I'm not going to look at it. I'm not going to look it up because like, at this point I can just power level through a lot of the game. Because Steady Shot's strong enough to OHKO a lot of stuff. On a side note, my PS3 controller finally fucking died. Like, it's been giving me problems for a while, and I tried hitting it to get it back to the way, back to a working state, but I busted it. Oh well, I'm not really worried about it, because it was giving me problems for a while. And I've been saying for forever that I need to get a new one. Get this, get this in Bue Quest 2 while I'm at it. Okay. Now someone will say you can upgrade these items and get, uh, 
enough dexterity. Yeah, I can, but oh well. <laughs> So, with that said, it might be a little bit before I record another segment of uh, Dino Crisis for those, for like the three people who actually were watching that or had any interest in it. Not quite sure why the, uh, not quite sure why these guys exist, the Claw Storm Terrors, if the, um, if the veteran tokens were removed. It's like, obviously, that was the whole point of them. You find them and you kill them to get the evil eyes, and then you make the, the recipe for your charm, but since that got removed... I guess they give good experience, but still. Since it got that got replaced with the Riftwalker quest, which I can't complain about that. I like I like that the charm is just or the reward is just in a charm that you can get to. And I don't have to worry about yeah, here I go again. The fucking Bane Hunters going extinct. I know a lot of people had trouble with uh, the fairy witches instead, but uh, I never had a problem with fairy witches spawning back then. Guess it's just me. Alright. Oh, I need to put another point in bark skin. Actually, wait, I don't... Actually, I'm not sure I can invest more than 10 points in this. Okay, that's... Okay, I can't invest more than 10. Okay, well, I like that very much. Also, 17,000 HP. That is that is kick-ass. So this is... I'm thinking this bear is going to be way stronger than the vanilla D2 bear. Open up. Alright. See how much... I almost have enough. I almost have enough... I almost have enough dexterity to wear that. Okay, for some reason I thought that gave poison resistance. Apparently I was mistaken. Uh, okay. Also, I don't have a, uh, I didn't even realize, or I didn't even think about this, but I don't even have a, uh, a, uh, arcane crystal to, to cube with my, okay, come on. There we go. Um, with my bow to make it tier four.
Oh. Okay, before I even do anything, I'm gonna purchase some, uh, fire resist MOs. Where is it? Okay, no more. No more. Uh, we good. Uh, okay. Excellent. Oh yeah, I forgot to hand that in. Oh well. So, my fire resist is capped. Now I just need to do the same for uh, everything else, which... Eh, the gold on that will be quite expensive at this point, but... I'm heading on... I'm approaching Act 2, so that... I can at least farm Grubber. Hey, that's lasting an awful long time now. Go. Get the hell out of here, Black Knight. Go, get out. this in here right now before I accidentally right-click it and use it. Alright. So. Also, I should probably resummon my harvesters when they die. I just need to keep watch for the the corruptor mages whatever they're called I don't think they were ever called cor actually I think that's what their old name was the uh, the poison orb dudes anyway I gotta keep watch it for them since my poison resistance is still negative I'm not sure what they're called now but you know you know what they are. Oh, this will be fun. Okay, so whenever I get an arcane crystal, I can uh, I can level up my bow to level four, tier four, whatever. Alpha Centaur, get the hell. Okay, I'm already experiencing, uh. I'm already seeing where, uh, Cascade will be better than, uh. Maybe not, actually. That guy just seems tough. What's my chance? To oh, 75%, okay. It would help if I'd get that up to 90. Or 95. But anyway, um, I was going to say, I see where Cascade is going to be more useful than Steady Shot for mob clearing. Uh, wrong button. Uh, 438. I'm pretty sure that's good. 
Okay, four, ooh, 431. That was higher than I thought it was. Okay, so now I can focus on uh, upgrading my armors. Ah, ha, ah, ah. ha. max skill level. Or not skill level, but uh, skill point. Speaking of which, let's hand in the... Hand in that. So... Was this on kill or striking? It was on kill, okay. Oh, they are still called Corruptor Mages. Okay. Also, bears... Bear, you might... I'm not sure if you're immune to poison or not, but you don't turn green. Or are you untargetable? No, you know, you're tar... Actually, you know what? You'd have to be targetable. Um, let's see... Where might it be? No. There it is. Well, couldn't get all of it, but at least I got some. So at least that's not in the negative anymore. I'll have to get some cold resistance too for uh, the the day stars in the arcane sanctuary next. And then lightning resist might not be Actually, wait, I'll need some of that, too, frick, for, uh, um, what's-his-face? The Haradric Mage at the end of, uh, the Tomb of Ta Tal Rasha. The guy you kill to get access to Binding a Bale. There we go. All points into strength for better for better gear. So with this loadout, I only need to get my strength up to 391 uh, for tier four jetons. 74. Let's see. Oh, speaking of which, I have a new uh, max new skill point to invest in. So. Pathfinder, Bear, Steady Shot, Bark Skin. Um, I'll put points into Elven Song eventually because of symbiosis synergy and nothing else. Like, I, why would I ever need... Well, actually, I will use them for meat shields if whenever I start investing in them. Also, that'll be nice to have at level... level 115 plus dealing with shit like Column Grad.
and you're dead. So mana's not a problem now. I mean, it kind of is, but it's... I'm doing enough damage that it doesn't really matter. Hmm. Actually, I think I will invest in harvesters now. Okay, there we go. At least I have the max number of them. These things are creepy looking. Oh wait, I'm going the wrong way. I'm thinking I found the boson armor already. No. It's w I'm surprised that that was found so early. I doubt there's any lightning cast or sorceresses, so... There we go. I would have... I thought sets could only be found in, like, Karas 3000 and, uh, Act 4, Nightmare, or Beyond. Oh. Simply because, as you see, you can't even use this until you hit level 90. And you'll never... You'll never be at level 90 unless someone... Unless you spend an inordinate amount of time grinding. Or if you... And even then you might not be able to. To get that far. Or if, uh... Actually, I don't even know. I don't even know where else you'd be able to farm that much. You can't go into Duncraig on Hatred now, like you used to be able to do. I definitely can't invest more than 10 points into the skill, which I'm glad, because there's no chance of me accidentally putting more points than necessary. Uh, 
Don't disenchant that. Now it's up here. Okay, so cold res. Not very much. So now I just gotta get my resistances higher, which uh, I guess I'll just off screen farm when I'm done. Farm grubber for a while. Also get my uh, shitty, my shitty blue amulet, blue quality amulet on uh, normal difficulty. The reason I do normal difficulty specifically is because they it'll have the lowest item level requirement, so I can fit more mo's in there. Now, obviously, I'll look for, like, I'll keep my eye out for good rings and amulets, but uh, not for right now. Also, I'll farm Neolithok a bit to get my gear as high as it can go. Ah, uh, yeah, this is why I need resistances. architect. It's up here. Okay, what the fuck? Okay, I, th I thought for a moment I wasn't actually hitting the, the glacial spires, but no, I was. And I could just power level through, uh, er, I can just power my way through this crap with life leech. Okay, well here I'll need Cascade. Okay, yeah, Cascade can hit from potentially further away than, uh, uh, steady aim, steady shot. Okay, I always, I'm still, I'm still in the mindset that this drops from Izawal, not Summoner. My brain cannot comprehend changes. Alright, let's see. Half, sim half symbol, I think that's over here. Pretty sure it's one of these. Yep. Okay. 
see, I, yeah, I'm kind of learning. Any, I'm kind of learning. Do I have enough lightning res for this? I hope so. Zoltan cool. Coolie. Alright. Now for those of you who did not see the stream, or were not a part of it, um... I, by this point, I had a group of like seven, eight, or actually I think it was like six or seven people, and we killed Duriel in like eight seconds. Literally, we counted like, I counted like eight seconds. That was pretty good. Uh, come on. Rip, Duriel. Oh, get out of there. Okay, so at this point, I am going to end the segment here, and off-screen I will farm for gold, farm for arcane crystals, upgrade the, this stuff as far as I can, and I'll do the fetch quest, because even if you didn't see the stream, nobody real I don't think anyone really cares to see this done, like in any capacity. So, see you guys next time.